this past week, there's been a report of a Hero Photon electric scooter. The manufacturer was quick to point out that that the fire is the outcome of a short circuit at the socket. The scooter was being charged overnight. The other fire in focus was an incident in Chennai at Aether dealership. The company says the fire erupted in a vehicle that had been brought to the service center following an accident. Once dust was washed off the vehicle, the team realized there was a crack in the battery pack top casing when removing body panels. This crack is likely an outcome of the accident. Because of the wash, water entered the battery pack. The company also noticed a few screws around the battery had been replaced. Their varying lengths could have heightened stress on the battery top panel. A report earlier in the week, which puts blame on cheap materials that don't meet quality criteria. The probe result was furnished by CFEES of the DRDO, Defence Research and Development Organisation, and Indian Institute of Science, Bengaluru. Electric scooter fire incidents led to notices being sent to multiple manufacturers. Incident explanations are sought from Boom Motors, PureEb, Ola Electric, Okinawa Autotech, and Jitendra Eb. With the scooter fire reports from this week, due diligence and audits for the same are expected. In light of the recent spate of battery-related fires occurring inside electric two-wheelers across the country, the union government has asked all electric two-wheeler brands to refrain from launching any new products in the market. The Ministry of Road Transport and Highways held a meeting in the capital recently to discuss the rise in battery-related fires that have become something of a public health concern. While electric two-wheeler makers are free to sell current models, several have issued recalls to further investigate the cause of these fires. Okinawa issued the biggest recall with 3,215 scooters going back to base Pure AV, which has been mired in fire-related incidents since last year, also forms a major portion of the number of recalled scooters with Polar Electric having recalled 1,441 scooters. It should be noted that Ola did this after a single incident of battery fire occurred in Pune. But the actions are in line with the government's instructions that the entire batch of scooters be recalled, even if a single scooter malfunctioned. Union Minister Nitin Gadkari threatened brands with penalties if they failed to recall the scooters in time. In accordance with this directive, even brands which have seen no battery-related fires will not be launching any A-scooters this year. How brands react to what has only been a verbal suggestion so far, remains to be seen. The move has been made to provide the government more time to set up the right body of authority and take a closer look at the cause behind these incidents, while it does prevent brands from launching faster, bigger and potentially more dangerous versions of these scooters, it also prevents brands from launching improved versions of lackluster products. What happens to electric vehicle brands waiting to make their debut in the Indian market remains to be seen.